Hello everyone, ladies and gentlemen, man, woman, and child alike. I am Levi with F My Game, and you can call me whatever you'd like because you know what? It'll just roll off my back if it's something negative. So go ahead and give me your worst right now. Try and come up with your worst insult you can. Um, and as you can see, we are running Minecraft Beta 1.9, pre release number 6, where doors do not work properly. So this might be a little bit interesting. Good thing trapdoors still work well. Um, let's check our mushroom farm. What we are going to do today is we are going to work on our uh, our mushroom farm is boring, has not done anything. Okay. We are going to work on a watermelon farm, actually. Um, so I'm going to come down here and I'm just going to make a little room. Uh, we're also getting cobblestone so we can make our, our underground passage to the nether. As you've, if you've been watching, that's what we've been working on. If you have not watched those, feel free to go back. Um, if you don't want to, if you don't have time, whatever excuse you have to not watch my videos, it's okay. I, I won't take it personally. I'm taking it very personally, and you've hurt my feelings. And we're hitting somewhere serious here. We got some dirt over there. Um, and I just want to remind you right now, sometime during this video, when you find it hits that quality threshold for you to give it a thumbs up, do so. Um, maybe, maybe that quality threshold is right now here in my voice. I am happy and I am excited. And I am drinking some crystal. Um, oh, let me clarify. Some crystal geyser. Or, or it, it almost reads crystal geyser. But it's geyser. It's some bottled water. Um, and it's bottled at the source. Natural alpine spring water. Um, you know what also comes from natural alpine springs? Um, my tap water. Uh, I live in Oregon. We have nice tap water here. Yet we still have a high demand for bottled water because we like drinking things that come out of things that pollute our things. Um, yeah, that was a mouthful, but it's a pretty serious thing. Um, water bottles pollute a lot of crap, and it kind of. Like, there's lots of recycling for them. Yes, I know. Now there's a five-cent deposit for them, too. Um, which I gotta remember, because I'm so used to just, like, crushing water bottles and throwing them in the recycling bin after and them. But now, I believe there's five-cent water or return on it. Let me let me see. I'm gonna check this thing and try and mine at the same... Yeah. So, in Oregon and in Hawaii, there's five-cent returns. I don't really know why that's just in those two. Maybe this... Like, do you guys have bottled returns for for plastic water bottles after you use them um because i'm from oregon we have pretty damn awesome tap water and we have it um so yeah let me know if you guys have water bottle five cent ten cent return or whatever because usually when you have something it, it says like all the states that give it to you um but this one just says oregon and hawaii which i thought it was a lot more widespread than just oregon and hawaii and i feel like hawaii's like always had these these returns and I found the cavern of doom and my shovel's dead so here's the cavern of doom. apparently a squid fell down the water and killed itself there you see the two ink sacks what a what a, what an emo squid killing himself um, so here's this and we're going to I think we're gonna go. Let's let's save this pick in case I want to get some more obsidian sometime. Um, and we're going to place dirt in a grid fashion. But let's let's even it up with this dirt. <laughs> um, so we have extra headroom to sit in, even though there's gonna be like a hole here, and I already places down to fill it out. Um, so we're kind of being a little counterproductive here, but it's he <laughs> okay. Because we're getting extra cobbled this way, um, and it, it's it's fine. We'll be fine. We'll be f we're we're great. We're doing we're doing we're 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 stuttering, and I just placed it right where I didn't want. Great. So we're just gonna complete this floor a little bit here. Maybe oh we don't have a shovel. I don't have any iron with me either. Grr. Why don't I have iron with me? Why don't I have a good shovel? I have a whole bunch, bunch, of, bunch, of, bunch. Of. When I say a bunch, I mean like a crap load of 
of iron. I have like four full stacks, I believe now. And that's pretty ridiculous. And four stacks is going to be hard for me to carry it all, to die at once and lose it all. Um, so unless there's like a, a, a lava fall. <laughs> yes, there's such thing as a lava fall. Haven't you ever seen a lava fall? No? Well, maybe you should go to Middle Earth more often, okay? Um, I'm not going to lose all the iron at once. It's going to be cool. I mean, I could lose like a whole stack of it in armor, I suppose, if I make a, a full set of armor. Um, but hopefully we'll enchant stuff somewhat soon and we won't even have that problem. So let's see, let's, let's, uh, close this off a bit. Let's close it off with, um, some more dirt. Um, and I thought about, I, I talked about earlier making this out of, uh, pistons, right? Um, but then I realized you have to, you have to till the sand afterward to actually make it work. Um, so pistons wouldn't work all that great. Um, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this, this, the stems in like a, a, a checkerboard pattern like that, right? Um, and that way they will grow. So you have, you have one here and it'll grow stuff here. And it's connected there because it seems like the more it's connected to one block, the faster it'll grow. Maybe I'm wrong, but that's just how I'm going to do it. And I like how you can till stuff and it literally just cuts off the extra. Because you can like see where there's no block there. So if I took this out, it's like, oh, hey, look, it was darkness in there. Um, so yeah. Um, and I don't know if you need water to grow them either, but I guess I can go get some, some water in a bucket and put some like a water channel through here or something. Maybe I'll just dig that out right now. Except for I don't have the shovel, so never mind. I'm gonna go back up and get a shovel and a bucket of water. Jump. We're going up that and we're getting out Let's see I've got a bucket oh there's a bucket in right here okay we'll get a bucket and we will we will we will go over here and grab some iron not the saddle we're not gonna ride anything yet and we are going to make two shovels one a shovel and a two a shovel and then a couple of picks a one a pick, a two a pick. Um, what else we got? Sword. Oh, I could be making an axe, but I don't really need an axe right now. Let's dump the wheat. You know what? Let's let's make the wheat into some bread. I feel like making some bread. So let's bake some bread on our crafting table. I believe it's just three like this. So we'll go like this. We got thirty-two there, five there, five more there one there and one there so we got a lot of bread now and I believe bread just fills one one food thing but I don't remember now I got 54 bread all together wow that's actually quite a bit of bread I've never had that much bread in my life well in real life I eat a lot of bread not that much bread that's a lot of bread and that was a really crazy ramble okay do I need anything else before I go back down the seeds let's get the seeds and the water we want the water bucket we got the bucket right here. Do I, should I just get two buckets? Let's see, I have an empty bucket right there. Let's just get two buckets. Let's get two buckets. Two buckets of water in our broken door system. Running across here and taking some water. Oop, I put the water back. Let me get it out of the middle of nowhere and it filled itself back up. So we're running back in here. We're turning around. We're closing the door behind us. Getting down here, we're closing that door behind us. Uh, we're opening this door. Jumping through, closing that door behind us. No! Yeah, I got it, okay. And we're right Ooh. here. Oh, I hurt myself. Oops. Um, so let's see, let's, let's, let's dig this out, I suppose. This will be our, hello, get away, get away. Not cool, bro. That's why I had you blocked off. Let's get the dirt out, because we don't want to waste our cobble at this point. Get the 
creepy noise going on. So I suppose I should, like, um, go light in that area. Yep. Nope. Not doing. Let's go like that. And get out of here. And let's just take a little bit further and go. Bam. So that should, like, liquefy all this water here or all this stuff here and we'll do it on this side too except we're gonna might extend this let's just keep it like that for now um, let's get the seed out and not throw my sword on the ground because that's not very productive that is not the right tool so these stems will have to take some time to grow oh I killed it I, can, I thought I jumped all the way over it. No. Let's check it like that. And then we're going to go like that for now. Let's get some more light up in this biznitch. So we got lots of light. Oh, that one, that one died too? Man. It's watermelon harvesting. It's not as easy as they make it seem on the Food Network. And then right there. And, oh, I am out of seed. Man. So hopefully this will work somewhat decently. I don't know the mechanics of watermelon growth. Um, I feel like you really eat watermelon and just poop in the ground and have a new one grow up because that's basically how it works in real life. Um, that's how animals spread seeds is they eat it and they just poop it, poop it out in their poop. And then plants grow, you know? Alright, so that's that's that. I got I got some let's how much cobble have uh, I can't talk. How much cobble do I have? I have enough for now, I suppose. Two full stacks plus a little handful. So we're gonna go up and then close this door and go up. Maybe. What? I went through the door. We're going up. And let's go back out to our uh, underground thing, my Bob. Open the freaking door. It's gonna get me every time. A nice field of wheat. Let's grab some watermelons. So we eat it out on the, the road. I'm gonna leave the wheat here for now. It seems like wheat's growing faster now. But maybe that's just my imagination because I have so much of it. I can't tell. And I'm just gonna let more of it grow out before I go and harvest it. I got a whole stack of watermelon too. Man, it's a lot of watermelon. And. We are almost here. Oh, sprinting. <gasps> Alright, I guess I'm not breathing because I'm underwater now. It'd be terrible to sprint and be out of breath and then have to hold your breath underwater. It's like that would suck. Maybe that's why I don't do athletics. Not because I have to run and then be out of breath. Maybe that's why swimming sucks, because you're out of breath and you're in water. I guess you're not always underwater when you're swimming, though. Hmm. Now I'm just making up confusing stuff for myself. That. So we got those two frames there. Hopefully that's correct. Put this down. Let's see. I'm gonna put glass in these windows. And then same thing over here. And then we can do a strip of glass down this way. There. Let's see, do I want that filled? No, I want it like this for now. 
and then so that's basically where my frame will be so I want this to come out like this oh I missed it so like that and then we're going to corner there so the frame goes there this spot's filled this spot's filled that spot's filled that spot's filled and we're left with this wall that one's covered with stuff so now you're like this this and that and then here get the glass out and put the glass here And then we can fill the rest of this up. So this one can be glass in the middle here. And then fill that in. Alright, so I think we're ready to put our obsidian in, in one spot. I guess one of these has to be just a holder for now, because we don't have the full two yet. So I want to put it right on that side, so we're going to put this here. Come over to this side. Put that in. So we're going to have to run back and grab our obsidian here shortly. No hole in that side, so that's fine. Alright, so thank you very much for watching this episode of Minecraft with FMI Gaming. I am Levi, and I still am. I have been, will be, and um, will pass, present, and future. Will be. That's a lot of creepers. <sighs> a challenger approaches. Get the sword. <sighs> Run away from our structure stuff. Come fight me, creeper. Ah! Yeah, but what you can't you can't sizzle after you're dead. It's not fair, bro. Run over here. Nope, nope, you can't do that. At least you didn't hit my path. You just made a hole right next to it, you jerk. Get my experience. Hello, creeper. Time to die. Does jump shotting actually make more damage against him? Does it, does it do more damage? Um, someone said it did. It was I think it was supposed to a while back. Maybe it was sprint, like, like sprint jumping. Stupid creepers always destroying my stuff. At least this game has better hit detection than. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna hate on any Call of Duty games or BF3, but some of those games have pretty bad hit detection. And like collision detection, like it's can be so bad. But a lot a lot of that can be because of the latency issues. So I'm not gonna rip on that. But I'm gonna get out of here. Thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe, like, favorite, comment. Whoa! No 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 no! What? You can't just do that, Mr. Creeper. You can't just do that. I'm a hard-working man, and you can't just, like, blow up my shit because you feel like it, Mr. Creeper. Jesus. You are not a very good person. <sighs> I'm gonna fix this. Come on. And now I'm hungry from all that running and fighting, so I'm just gonna eat my watermelon here. There's more watermelon out there already. Good thing I have so much freaking watermelon, you jerks. <sighs> Let's go get the watermelon. Let's hit it with wheat. It seems like it'd be a good idea. <laughs> oh, hiccups. One watermelon. Two watermelon. And three watermelon, thank you. And now get the hoe out. 
and wha-bam. Get off the soil. And get back home before... What? He blew out a window too? Damn. Creeper just like shattering everything. Alright, so I'm going to get out of here before I ramble on forever. Um, put the egg, some extra stuff in here. Mumble, mumble, mumble. Um, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Tomorrow probably. Goodbye. Oh, it's raining. Ah. Oh.